Ah, oh, come on, I just want to chop this weed down. Huh, so I need a higher tool? Okay, I'm going to show you how to make the level 2 axe. So right now, we need to get some spider webs. So I'm just going to cut this down. So we got one. So I can get this one over here as well. And some dinner. Grab that. Now, if you're not sure where to find the spider webs, all you really have to do is just basically go around this tree. You'll be bound to find some spider webs. There is one over there, but I'm not going to risk it because there's a wolf spider right in there. So we'll leave, we'll leave that one. But there is easier ones, which I showed that were over that way. So once you've got your webs, you then want to go back to Burgle's lab or an analyzing station that is close by and you want to analyze the spider webs. So from here, you will now have unlocked the spinning wheel and that's the next step in uh, getting the ax, the level two ax. So you will have to make this and as you can see, there's a, this is all the parts that it requires. So you just need clay, you need the ant parts, stuff. it's pretty easy to make. I have just finished making this. Now what you want to do is you want to just start making that silk rope. So start making it there. I haven't analyzed it yet, which I'll probably go do in a sec. So yeah, we'll just, you know what, I'll just craft all of them. They take a little bit of time to make while we wait for that. The next parts that we will need, bombardier beetle parts. Now you can find them, I'll just show on the map, it's probably easier. So if you go on the other side, they are around this location here. You can find them in other locations, but this is just where I go to get them and to kill them. Well, the only thing is, um, Fergie kind of usually does uh, most of the killing. I don't know if I really want to go over there, but I, I might give her a text and see if she can help me kill some. Okay, well that didn't end well. Or oh, she's just she's just sending me lots of uh, poop emojis now. But um, I guess I'm just gonna have to do it on my own. So yeah, thanks thanks a lot, Fergie. Thanks a lot. Now I have made a lean to just in case if I die. So I'm gonna set my spawn point. So probably a good idea if you've never really killed these guys before. I usually have, yeah, the, the backup of Fergie is usually very helpful, but she's busy on holiday. Alright, come here you guys. Yeah. Alright, so that is done. For the next part, you will need a ladybug head and I think some ladybug parts as well. I'm not going to show that on this video, but I do have a great video for that so definitely check that one out i have a great way showing how to kill them i'll put the link in down below as well so you can go find that video i've managed to kill a ladybug now unfortunately this time i didn't get uh, a head so it does take a few tries to get a ladybug head so keep that in mind so i'm gonna try again for the second time around i managed to get a ladybug head so yay all right so once you've done that you just basically want to analyze all of your stuff, so I'm just doing it now. So I'm going to analyze all of that. Once you're back at your base and you've got your workbench all set up, you then want to go into your tools and then here it is, the insect axe. So this is the level 2 one and craft. And there we go you have yourself your level 2 axe. Now you can just pretty much, um, yeah, just, just you know, bin this trash, this one. Yep, we don't need it anymore, because we have this. 
before I end the video, I just want to mention a few things. By having the level 2 axe, you get way more weed stems. So I'm just going to quickly show you guys. And voila! Last thing I want to mention is that when it comes to repairing your tool, you're going to need these two things. So make sure you have stocked up on these ones. So you're just going to have to keep killing these. Alright, other than that guys, I'm going to end the video here. Don't forget to like and subscribe, really helps me out. Alright, bye guys!